this is my 1992 Mercedes Formatic Estate, uh, which I've had for uh, 18 years now. It's never been garaged, so even though it's not been garaged, the condition is absolutely amazing. I've had some minor repair jobs done on the bodywork over the years. I had a few bits of rust coming through on the surface of the wheel arch there. I had those done. Um, nothing really here has been done to it. Tires have been wearing fairly well. It's done. The car's done. Um, 100. And I think 103,000 miles. I've had it since it was about 31,000 miles. And I think I've only had maybe two pairs of sets of tires on it. Everything works on it. Well, one minor thing that doesn't, but doors, I mean, look, they just close. Everything is just beautiful. Air conditioning works, though I have, I have spent money on it. And, uh, upgraded compressors and things, but it is working. It's got the seat in the back, of course. It's got the all the original gubbins that came with it are in these boxes here, on the side. There's the, um, for example, the tow bar that is in a little velvet bag that fits underneath. I have added that high level light. Self-closing door. Aerial works but I have replaced it over the years. The only thing that I can recall that doesn't work on this car is sadly <laughs> the heated seat on the driver's side. The back, the heated back of the seat works, but not the, the seat itself. The heats, heats all work on this passenger seat. And all the lumbar supports work, because this car has the lumbar support both on the passenger side and the um, driver's side. And they work by two or three little levers here and wheels that you move and air is pumped up all over the place to adjust the uh, padding in the seat. It's got uh, memory seats, two memory positions there on the driver's door. So the aircon works, it's got air, it's got um, sunroof as well. And it's got climate control. So It's a nice car and uh, considering it's almost 25 years old, as I say I've had it 18 years. It's the uh, Formatic of course, four wheel drive, uh, which though I had problems with it and I had to fit a new transfer box, uh, works really well now. And it has its uses, I mean it doesn't drive in four wheel drive at speed or anything, but up to about 30 miles an hour is, is the, the maximum speed that it engages, but it's really useful if, you, if you're if you on wet grass, the usual situation where a car gets stuck or or in snow, it will it will pull you out even though of course you've only got road tires, but it is noticeably better than a rear wheel drive estate. So it's a useful vehicle and, and it's a novelty because there's not many of them left now, this original formatic system. So there we are. I hope in another 20 years or so the car is still looking as good. I polish it and clean it a bit, that's all, but um, I don't overdo it. And the paintwork has stayed really good.